Hello everyone, and welcome back to Kirby Superstar Ultra. Today, we're not going to start with the tree arena. I don't think I'm even going to do the tree arena today. I think today we're going to do Helper to Hero stuff, and then uh, Samurai Kirby and Megaton Punch. But we're going to start with Helper to Hero. I want to knock out at least four of these things today if I can. And then also do some of the minigame stuff. Because we've still got, what have we done, five of these and there are 20? we got 15 more to go. we got some work to do. I've been told that Suplex, aka Bugsy, has an air attack where you, if you're in the air and you press down B, you do an attack that deals damage without needing to grab a star or anything. So that's a lot better for trying to win the game with Bugsy. It's still going to be a nightmare, I'm betting, but it won't be as impossible as I originally thought. Uh, let's do Bomb. Let's do something that I'm not a fan of to start. Which is the worst way to start a session, but let's see if we can get it done and out of the way. What, what can you do with bomb other than just throw a bomb? Ready bomb, ready bomb plus B for bomb throw. Set throw angle by holding B. Dash bomb throw, B near foe for a bomb drop, and then down B for a bomb set. Alright, so really just, we're just going to be spamming the throwing of the bomb. Is what I'm hearing from that. Bomb is not, like... It's not like I'd rather be normal Kirby instead of Bomb. Like, I'd rather have Bomb, obviously, because it's something. And as you can see, it did okay against Wispy Wood. Wispy Woods, whatever, but it's definitely one of my least favorite powers. I'm trying to think of anything that I like less than it. Probably Suplex. So it's around my second least favorite. But it's not terrible. It's definitely better in su than Suplex in the fact that we can just very easily use an attack. Like, we just throw the bomb. That's all it takes. As you can see, it works out okay. I just much prefer other abilities. Bomb probably isn't even as bad as I make it out to be. I definitely hate the having to angle things. I much prefer just being, a oh, you cannot uh, glide jump while holding, uh, or glide, whatever, like double, triple infinite jump when you have a uh, bomb in your hand. Duly noted. So after those first two bosses, I don't think that uh, winning with bomb is going to be difficult necessarily. But uh, Krako is going to be annoying, that's for certain. Yeah, I really don't like bomb. But we should be able to win with it. It might just take a little while. And if that's how it goes, then that's how it goes. There aren't too many bosses, I'm trying to think of any others besides Krakow, where you can't just uh, attack them dead on most of the time. Uh, Camellio Arm sometimes, Dino Blade is probably the only main one other than Krakow, which we've beaten Krakow, so... So far, so good. And in case you couldn't tell, we're uh, not going for any speed records with uh, Poppy Jr. here. King DDD is actually super easy with Bomb, it looks like. Then again, DDD is, like, pretty easy to beat with anyone. Because the way the boss works, where if you just hit him, then he gets stunned, is terrible. But I love that penguin regardless. Dino Blade might be a bit of an issue. I'm trying to think, I don't think Fatty Whale would be a problem. Meta Knight might be a bit of a... Did you see that bomb was stuck there? That was weird. I can still, like, just spam it on Dino Blade, actually, which is great news. Meta Knight might be a bit of a problem, potentially. Ow. I was bound to get hit eventually. I'd really like to kill you before... Yep, awesome. Before you can fly up or anything. What, what are you doing? I've defeated you. You exploded. Your health bar... Okay, good. That was weird. Meta Knight might be a problem. Uh, heavy Lobster should be fine. Computer Virus should be okay. It just really depends on how much damage we deal. Which I think will be okay in that. Because we can hit the Computer Virus easily. And as long as you can hit it easily, normally you'll do enough damage. I think Wham Bam Jewel might be the most troublesome with bomb power setup. I knew you'd do the center. I knew it. I'm always prepped for you to do the center attack. Bum, bum, bum. We've almost got him dead. Does he, uh... Does he come from the side? Yeah, we can kill him right here, I bet. Get out of here. There we go. Alright, easy. This is actually going way better than anticipated, which is really good news. I would love to just start the session by getting one of my least favorite powers done and over with. Just keep throwing. Never stop throwing. I wonder if his tongue can, uh, eat the bomb. I'm not going to try and test it because I'm more worried about winning. 
this is going to be annoying. Did you really just, like, block the bomb? He's blocking. Ow. All right, Camellia Arm is going to be a bit more of an issue than I originally anticipated. This is the chance to get a lot of hits off. Oh, he's... I thought that he would go up into the air next, not run at me like that. Got him. We've done it. All right. This is actually going fantastically well. We're already down to the last six. Mini bosses shouldn't be a problem for bomb power. Hopefully. I hate this guy. I hate this guy so much. I never realized how much I disliked this mini boss until this playthrough. There we go. I mean, he's still not difficult because no, none of the mini bosses are really hard, per se. But, uh, that was dumb of me. But it's fine. We've barely taken any damage so far, so we can afford a little bit. See you later. This is actually going insanely better than I thought it would. We're probably going to have more trouble with Ninja and... I tried to jump away, but I wasn't fast enough. Probably going to have more trouble with, um... I was holding a bomb! I was like, wait a minute, why am I not gliding over him? That's not how that works. I'm going to take a maximum tomato just to be safe. I think we'll be fun. I should be at... What do we have? We have, uh, this heavy lobster and computer virus, and then it's Meta Knight. I should be able to get through Wispy Woods, heavy lobster, and computer virus with, uh... What the heck was that? I thought that it would do a big jump again, but that's not how it works. This is fine. This is fine. We should be able to get through this boss and the next two, which is heavy lobster and computer virus, with, uh, out taking too much damage so that we can... I really thought I'd hit him and kill him there. Yeah, we didn't take much damage there. We're fine. Get back to full with this. Near full, at least. Just gotta get through Heavy Lobster, who, as long as I'm not stupid about, should be easy. I gotta be careful about holding bombs, because you need to jump a good bit over Heavy Lobster. So, not being able to because a bomb is in my hand would be less than ideal. Oh, dear. Like that right there. Oh, he's doing flamethrower off-screen. That is ideal. Computer Virus, we should be good to get through without dying. I'd be pretty surprised if we died to Computer Virus. Please just die. Thank you. Yeah, it went perfectly. I think we're gonna win this. As long as I can beat Wham Bam Jewel. And Meta Knight. Meta Knight might be a bit of an issue with bombs. Meta Knight is not super easy to hit. Oh, dude, bomb is great. 64 damage. I mean, it's great. You predicted me so hard, I deserve to be hit there. Bomb is amazing against this guy. I didn't realize how fast you could throw them out. Normally, the enemy gets invincibility frames after the first hit, so rapid-firing them doesn't help very much, but apparently computer virus doesn't. That is great news. Go ahead and store up your power. I kill you in two more, it looks like. Yeah, that is fantastic, actually. 94 damage, my word. Surprised I didn't get hit there. Turns out the bomb is the, uh... computer virus slayer. Who would have guessed? I was hoping that I could catch him with the one on the ground at the same time as he dropped. Oh, well. Talons. Easy dodge. We're definitely getting through this just fine. So we'll get to use a tomato to get back to full for Meta Knight. And then we'll have a tomato to get back to full for Wham Bam. Aha! Not this time. Your wizard friend already got me with the fire blast. Not again. Yeah, he got invincibility frames on one of those, it looked like. I was hoping if I got closer, I might be able to, uh, get, like, the 94 damage I had against the knight that one time. What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, yeah. Well, you know what? I'll just take the hit on that one, to be honest. 94, 94. Ah, uh, he got invincibility frames on one. I think he would have lived anyways. We got him next one, though. And it's just the talons. I don't think there's any attack he has that could have done enough damage to kill us. We've done it. This is going fantastically. I really did not expect to do so well with Bomb. Is, is Bomb actually, like, a really good ability, and I just irrationally hate it? Let's go, Meta Knight. You and me. Take that. That that should have been a hit. I disagree with my timing being off there. The game is wrong, not me. No. See, Meta Knight can deal a lot of damage really fast, is what I'm worried about. And uh, he also has a good bit of HP on top of that. So I'm a little afraid. No, no, no. What are you... Oh, okay, I know this. Oh, I thought he would go through a few more times, not just come right back. Yep, see, if Meta Knight... If Meta Knight gets you on a good combo, he does tons of damage. And that's what I was worried about with fighting him, but it looks like we're gonna be fine. 
Meta Knight, I really just need you to thank you. All right, yeah. This entire thing has gone way better than I anticipated, which is great news. All right, all we got to do is beat Wham Bam Jewel. And his prior form, of course. Ah, uh, two bombs off is nice. Try and predict it a little bit to make sure I get that second hit. Yep, nice, nice. So far, so good. Two hits on that is also really nice. Ow. Oh, I didn't get hit there? That was weird. Didn't get two hits, but that's okay. There's the grab. Next is uh, the fist. The triple is next? No, he's dropping the fingers next. Yeah, I pretty much accepted that I was going to be hit there. Here's the triple. Normally, this is where I kill him. I messed that up by accidentally doing the dash thing. Almost killed him. He's going to come across. He's out. Memorizing this guy's patterns, especially because we have to fight him so much, is the optimal strat. Once you memorize how the thing goes, as long as you're careful, you can win. I didn't mean to throw that way, obviously. This is bad. I was too close there. We're going to have a bit of a harder time against the jewel version of the fight. I disagree with that damage. Laser beam is fine. I did get another hit off there. Oh, no, I'm holding the... I was holding the bomb. What are you doing? Fist. Easy dodge. Got two hits off. Nice. I hate this. Actually got a hit off there. Nice. Didn't think I would. All right, the triple. Definitely not killing him here, but we'll get him below half, which is great. I really wanted a second hit there. Oh, don't let... I'm mad at myself. Play careful. Play careful. Play careful. Got a hit there. Nice. Get a hit here, too. Didn't get a hit there. That's okay. Pay attention. Pay attention. All right. All right. I can still win this. Just play it safe. I shouldn't have been hit by that the first time. That was really bad. I, too, can use bombs. How dare you try and use them against me? Now he's getting... Uh, this is bad, because now he's so fast that it's hard to get a hit off. He brings his hand back up so quickly. Should have gotten more hits there. Oh, is this the triple again? That's perfect. I can kill him here. Please just die to this. No, I didn't mean to hold the thing. Rip. Play careful. Play careful. All right, you can get him here. I didn't get him there. Get him on this one. Oh, my word. There we go. Okay, we did it. Oh, man. I really thought that I was going to throw it at the end there. 11 minutes. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. It's not in our top three, obviously. Nothing is ever getting won over Bonkers. Bonkers is there for life. Like, maybe Yo-Yo or Sword Knight, I can beat Tack or Blade Knight's time, but Bonkers is there for the rest of existence. Let's definitely try and knock out one more. This time I'll play as someone I like more, probably. Man, we need to do... These three are, like, the worst. Bird on, Biospark, and Bugsy, those are going to be the worst. I need to do at least one of them today. Plasma was probably won't be too fun either. I kind of want to save Yo-Yo and Fighter for later, when I need, like, a pick-me-up after doing poorly on one. Jet is also going to be awful. Let's do, uh... Let's do Chili. See if we can get Ice knocked out. Got that. Got that. Got that. Okay. Obviously, the biggest uh, plus to Chili is freezing enemies. Can't really do that with bosses, unfortunately. This is doing really well, though. That Ice Breath does more damage than I anticipated, which is good. Get away from me. You're not getting me with your frying pan. I ain't about it. You best believe that I am prepared to take this as slow as I need to. Oh, wow. You actually can freeze those. Good to know. Be frozen. Throw the coconuts at me so I can just freeze them on your face. Oh, he's getting closer. I don't like it. Get away. If you could just die, thank you. Really appreciate that. So far, so good. Die, Bugsy. I'm going to have to play as you eventually, but for now, just die. That was bad on my part. That's fine. That's fine. Not the best to take our first hit on the second fight, but it was minimal damage. Krako could be a bit of a problem because we got to jump attack him. 
does do decent damage at least, but I'm worried about, like, we gotta get pretty close to land this thing. If I'd been hit there, I would've been upset at myself. Gotta get pretty close to hit him, and uh, he does contact damage, as we all know. Oh, dude, that was just fantastically lucky. I love that. That was great. Perfect time to go for the freeze. Do, 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 D, D, D. Can I just hold B and you'll die? Eventually? He's getting a little too close for comfort. I don't like it. Stay away. I don't like being in the corner like this. This never happens when I fight DDD. You know what? Get away from him. Good call, me. Good call. Just die of ice. Be frozen. There we go. We've done it, boys. Alright, Dynablade. Dynablade also needs a little bit of jumping, I think, so... Could be a problem. Can I actually, like, dash near him and then hold B and... Nope. Don't ever do that again. That was stupid and cost us health that I shouldn't have lost. Ow. All right. I'm already not a fan of fighting Dynablade with Frosty, which means I'm probably not going to be a fan of fighting Dynablade with Burning Leo either. It's working out pretty well now, now that I'm not trying to be fancy, though. Just stick to what you know works, Chaos. There we go. All right. Chili deals more damage than I expect, which is good. I think Fatty Whale is going to be a problem, though. Because, uh, getting hits on, uh, a constantly moving target like him is not easy for, uh, our short-range Frost Breath. I'm really mad about that, just in case you're wondering. Center? Nope. Yeah, th this is going to take a while. This fight is. Not a whole lot of, like, really good times to get hits off for a long time. We basically get, like, a small hit every now and then, and that's it. Across? Yeah, alright. Just let me in here. Dude, if I could freeze one of those at the right spot to hit him, that would be great, but I don't think I'm ever going to get fancy enough for that. I was really hoping to freeze him there. I took a hit for this, but I think it's worth it. Yep. I've taken way too much damage too early. Look at how low my health is. That's really bad, actually. I'm going to need to beat the next, like, two bosses without getting hit if we're going to make this work. I can't really afford to use a uh, healing thing just yet. Oh, my word. I hate the sliding. I end up going further than I... No, get up, get up, get up. I wasn't fast enough. This is bad. We got to heal after this one if I even make it out of this one. Fighting him when he's in the air might actually be perfect. With our uh, spin attack here. Thank you for attacking in that direction for some reason. There we go. All right, we made it out of that somehow. Basically, that means there's a chance. Heal up. Only six left. We still have two maximum tomatoes. I'm pretty worried about Meta Knight and um, Wham Bam right now, though. Especially after I got hit by that boss, of all things. I wish that the boss, the next one, would spawn while that uh, ice block was still there. I hate this guy so much. No. Please die. I need you to... Okay. This guy has too much HP. I'm so mad right now. You have no idea. Would you please die? He won't die. What? The, what is the deal here? How much health does that guy normally have? That was ridiculous. Also, I hate the slide. I've decided. I hate the slide dash. I move too fast, and it's too hard to stop moving. Also, uh, Chili's powers are all, like, close range. Like, the Frost Breath does not go very... Oh, my word. Yeah, I'm not gonna win this. The Frost Breath is way too short. Of all the things to lose, like, so much of my life against, the mid-boss All-Stars 2 is actually kind of embarrassing. All of the... Like, all of the mid... Star bosses too, whatever. Mid-boss all-stars. They're all, like, close range. When you're close to them, they do a lot of damage. Chili here has to be close range to be able to accomplish any... Oh, my word. He moved so fast. There was no way I was getting out of that. Chili has to get so close to the enemies to actually deal any damage. It sucks. I'm taking this, and I'm going to beat Twin Woods. Twin Woods should not be that difficult. As you can tell, because we do, uh... Their invincibility frames last, like, no time at all. Hey, wait a minute. Dodge these. 